Hello there. Uh, my tummy started hurting right as the stream started, which is great. Great timing. Okay. Well, let's continue this uh, brand new playthrough of Fallout 76. I have uh, I explained at the beginning of the playthrough, uh, but I spent about a year and a half or so not really playing regularly. Um, and it's honestly kind of a, it's refreshing to, to replay this game. Um, considering how big of a disappointment Starfield is, this is actually an enjoyable experience. Replaying arguably one of Bethesda's most hated games of all time, I would say. Uh, I don't, I don't even think Starfield has that, uh, has that claim quite yet, but I think... I think it's it's probably going to be that the case very soon because this game is actually really good and very fun and uh, it's it's incredible falling in love with it again after so many years oh, of course the microphone fell all right oh my god it keeps doing it just stay up I just need it like right here all right or actually Okay. There we go. Um, okay, let's continue the playthrough then. I did quite a bit of playing off stream. Uh, in fact, I uh, I messed up a lot on the uh, perk points that I applied and the cards that I grabbed. Um, but that's fine. It's okay. Got a free daily item. Gonna grab that. Um, and I did play a bunch of the stuff I'm not going to be playing on stream, like the, uh, the, co the multiplayer stuff, the public events, uh, the smaller events, uh, as well, just to level up. And, uh, I, I don't know how I did it, but I'm already level 25. It's, it's very easy to get up to, uh, this level apparently, but, uh, I'm assuming it's going to be way harder. To get to the later levels, I would I really want to try to get to level fifty because um, a lot of the good stuff is locked until then. So I think that's the goal to try to get to level fifty. Hopefully before the next stream, which is gonna be in a couple weeks from now probably. Um. But yeah, uh, I did a little bit of uh, management for the character. Uh, built myself a makeshift. Uh, camp with a lot of goodies to use so I'm gonna go ahead and grab my uh, stat boosts first because these will be helpful for later and I also have figured out what I want to do for my build I'm looking to the left and there's something interesting over there to the left by the balloons that is a random encounter um, I know what I want to do for my build and I want to do a stealth build but I don't want to do like the the typical melee stealth that's overpowered usually. I want to do like a ranged stealth build. Um, I'm pretty sure this is a random encounter. Yep. It's the lemonade stand. Sorry, the quote unquote lemonade stand. Oh, excuse me! Get the fuck out of here! Alright, uh see what they're selling. Hello? Mr. Squeeze? All proceeds go to the Master Jimmy, <laughs> the Master Jimmy Foundation. Support your local delinquent today. I mean, I agree, but um, I, if you saw what the lemonade required, I I wouldn't I wouldn't touch it with a five foot full five foot pole. Fuck my life. Yeah, that, you can buy the recipe there, too. Also, there's a hard lemonade recipe now, which is interesting. All right, let me continue with these stat boosts, because these are kind of helpful. Although, I wish they would last longer. I didn't realize they only last half an hour. But when you sleep, the well-rested bonus lasts an hour and a half. I kind of wish it was the same. Like, the same duration. Otherwise, you basically have to go back to your camp every half an hour, and that's kind of annoying. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna be doing a, a long-range stealth build with guns, and I do want to incorporate crossbows and bows into the build. Um, so right now I have a 
10 millimeter SMG and a crossbow. I do not have a suppress on the uh, and the SMG quite yet. Uh, I do need a lot of uh, I need a lot of aluminum and uh, all the other materials to craft the 10 millimeter SMG. And um, then I need to craft a bunch of them and then scrap them. Oh, you know what? I just realized something. I should make sure it even has a suppressor. Ooh, I hope I don't. I hope I didn't make the, a mistake here. What if I'm mistaken and this thing doesn't have a a suppressor? That'd be annoying. Ten millimeter. Hold on. Some machine gun. Fallout seventy six. Let me look in the wiki, because it usually tells you. It'd be really weird if it didn't have a suppressor. Um, barrel? Uh-oh. It looks like it doesn't. I guess I can check here. That's going to be kind of upsetting. It doesn't have a suppressor slot. Why? Why doesn't this have a suppressor slot? That's so dumb. Is there like an attachment with the suppressor? No. That's very strange, because I would love to have this as my backup, but it needs to be suppressed in order to work with the build. Okay, well, I guess we're going to get rid of this then. I spent money on the plans for this. Now I need a backup idea. I, I want, oh, the 10 millimeter is suppressed, I'm pretty sure. The pistol. That's kind of upsetting. That ruins the whole build idea I had. Well, I also I just spent a bunch of cards on on commando for the SMG. Man, that is upsetting. That is beyond upsetting. I've been wasting all my time today on this SMG. Well, I'll hold on to it for now. I did also just craft a bunch of ammo too. Ugh, I hate that. It's crazy because there's only two good SMG options, and this was the better one of the two. So I guess I'm better off with a rifle. I might as well finish this while, I, while I'm here. I wish these wouldn't take as long, too. It's kind of annoying. Any uh, insane player names in the group? No. What was the one, what was the, like, really funny one from last time? I'm trying to remember. I, I think it was I fuck fish, But it was F-U-C-C, -C, which is hilarious. I don't remember if I did this one already. Okay. So I should have uh, six stat boosts then. Agility, uh, endurance, intelligence, luck, perception, strength. And then the well rested, which I can refresh real quick. I don't know if it takes the whole time. And then I'll have the bonus, um, the team bonus as well, which I think is 10, or oh, 10, for uh, intelligence. All right, phone, calm down. Oh, I woke up too early. The notification in the top left popped up and I got confused. I hope it doesn't start over. I have no idea if it does. 
I guess I'm gonna have to go for the handheld maybe that might be the best option honestly I don't know but for now I guess I'll focus on the crossbow the good thing is that the crossbow doesn't have any attachments except for scopes but I already have all those I just need to keep leveling up to get a better a stronger one essentially and hopefully eventually uh, legendary ones oh my goodness that takes way too long okay let's focus on the goal for the playthrough story and some side quests um I could try to do a side quest real quick but so see these are the overseer uh, quests after the first few missions in the main story so we can ignore those order of the tadpole I'm not doing uh, that is <laughs> okay so apparently I can't do any of these because this one is to go investigate the mine shaft underneath uh, Nuka world that's to that'll eventually lead me to uh, dropping the nuke to spawn the uh, the boss the giant mole miner so we're not doing any of that uh, we're not doing horn right we're not doing the isolated cabin because that's for the shelters search the cabin for survivors listen to a father's goodbye yeah oh open the locker right I have a key I did a, an event and I have a key for this good thing it's near nuka world let's let's go do this just clear some of these side objectives and then we can do nothing but story for the rest of the stream. At some point, um, maybe next time even, I'm gonna stop doing the vanilla story briefly and do some of the Wastelander story. Because apparently, I'm pretty sure the bow is locked to Wastelanders. Uh, you get it near the beginning of the story, but uh, I would like to have that unlocked. Listen up. All blood eagles oh my goodness. I hate when this happens. It's just the ally quest, which I don't want to do. Come on down to Poseidon. Bring your friends. Your fan blood eagles. They'll get shredded too. Nuka World's pretty cool. I like the events that they added for this. Alright, let's go to the mine shaft over here and grab the whatever rewards are in it. I don't know if it's usually worth it. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay, now we're good. Oh, hold on. This is actually where the quest popped up. The one... Find Beckett? Oh, so I have to go in there to find the locker. I don't know where that is. Fuck. That's annoying. Why would it put it there? Unless that, that, I mean, that location technically didn't have raiders before, but now it does. Alright, I, I have some sneak. I took the sneak perk a couple times, so hopefully I'm extra, extra sneaky. But we'll see. How did that not kill him? That might be a problem. They know. They know. Great. So much for sneaking. I don't even know how to get in. Too bad I can't break that. Oh, it's over here. Okay, it's not even this... Whatever that building is. We're just gonna make our way over... And find the locker. It's in one of these, isn't it? There... No? One of these? No? Excuse me. Pardon me. I'm through. That's locked. I'm not in the mood. Can you get out of my way? There, it's probably one of these. 
There it is. Wait, what? This might be a problem. It won't let me. Oh, there we go. A cryolator? Interesting. Oh! I just removed their head! Seem to be in trouble here. Oh, I thought that was a person there. I might as well take what I can from their bodies and get the fuck out. Oh, and I'm encumbered. I am trying to keep an eye out for uh, aluminum. I really need that for gun crafting. Can you not? I need a workbench. They should have one around here somewhere. There we, I mean, this one technically works. Just gotta scrap all this. Plasma rifle. Ow! That's not nice. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. This was a mistake. A cryolator really wasn't worth it. I just hate that it's spot it's put that locker right at a occupied location. <sighs> All right. Um Fire breathers. So let's head over to the fire breathers and uh, continue the main story. The the we're going to the police or the fire station. In Charleston. Right. Also, yeah, when we're in Charleston, the uh, frame rate is going to plummet. So I did drop the um, graphic settings down to medium. It's not quite potato, but it's not quite, you know, as good looking as it was yesterday or the other day. <sighs> okay. Let's go become a fire breather. Oh, God, the frame rate's already just gone. It's been doing this when I get near these big cities. It just drops to zero for a couple seconds. Okay, we're good. Hopefully. And I'm on a 39, uh, 3090. 3060, by the way. A GTX 3060. Although, I think the problem is my CPU. It's just dog shit. I really do need to get a new one. I don't have chrome open, do I? No. Um, I remember you can get something from this, but I think you need to get access to it first. Or it's one of these uh, computers. I don't know which one it is. Oh, I have level one, I think. I just need to equip it. Well, since commando is going to be useless, I need to figure out an alternative then. So that I can have uh, lockpicking equipped right away. Oh, a crossbow bolts. Great. Lovely. Totally needed that. I think this is the vendor. Any aluminum in here? Stay safe Hello. Out there. What you got? Responded. Oh, I'm so bothered by the 10 millimeter SMG not having a suppressor. It's so frustrating. And man, I could have saved 900 caps. Training. Oh, I know that's the drum mag. I'm an idiot. We'll make a fire I think it was about 400 caps for the 10 millimeter SMG. I'm so upset that I wasted that money. Oh, gosh darn it. 
Okay. Let me see if I have anything to sell. Yes, I definitely do. Responders. Seem to be running low on steam packs. Mostly because I did a lot of high-end events in the game. Uh, those really drained my stim packs, so now I need to find more. I even grabbed the bonus, like the, the the stash of 10 that I put in my my stash. Uh, I'm getting rid of these. I'm literally not Fire eating them. The I've been over encumbered so many times today, I haven't even bothered to put that on. Or to, to, put that on, to eat the those pastries, because they give you... Uh, carry weight. Bonus. Right leg. Um. Yeah, sure, why not? I guess I could have scrapped that. You can gear up here. Okay, one of these robots down here wants to cool talk to me. Kitchen. Join the fire breathers. Today. Ooh, for me? I already know that, damn it. That was exciting for a brief second. I guess I could do a suppress 10 uh, combat SMG or combat shotgun. Maybe, I don't know. I need Join to find a replacement for this 10 mil SMG. Join the Soon. Terminal to begin. Um. Oh, right. You have to do the test. Hello there. Hey, you uh, want to talk for a bit? Um. No. I'm just gonna do the test. It's pretty easy. I don't even need to find the notes that are around this room. The tunnel you're traversing has begun filling up with a gas, strange gas that you're not, and you're without your breathing mass apparatus. Fuck my life, I can't read English. What do you do? Uh, light a match to find the source. No, um... Yeah, evacuate as quickly as possible. Uh, while traversing a smoke-filled building, your breathing apparatus has failed. Which of the following will serve as a best replacement? A water-soaked rag? Wouldn't that simulate... Um... What's it called? Waterboarding? I don't know. One of the following fire breathers has been burned. The area is painful to the touch, but no blisters are forming. They, uh, you're applying a cool compress. What's the next thing you should do? Gently bind the burn with clean bandages. Coat the burn with dirt. Tie a tourniquet above the burn. That won't help. Uh, while exploring a collapsed mine, your team leader flashes their safety light quickly three times. What does this mean? Oh, I don't remember this part. Uh, retreat immediately? One of your squad mates has caught a case of sludge lung. Yikes. Which of the following sets of ingredients, when cooked together, can be used as a cure? I don't remember. It's definitely not the one that says cram. <laughs> it's this one. That's pretty obvious. You stumbled upon a group of scorched, diseased people brandishing clubs. Which of the following is the only uh, uh, acceptable method of engaging them? Charge in and disable them with police batons. No. Fall back and engage from a distance. You captured a scorched, infected man who you recognize as a childhood friend. What do you do? Convince your friend to join the fire the responders. Bring him back to the station for questioning. End his life as per yeah, mercilessly as possible. 7 out of 7. Jesus. Exit, please. Get fucked. I passed. You've been here for years doing this. Literally, she's been here for years doing this. Trying to pass. It's really depressing. Am I mean? I think I'm being mean. Give me all your aluminum. I don't know if any of this has aluminum. Complete the physical exam. Yeah, I forgot about that. Oh, get a hollow tip. Automation used to define life in West Virginia. Now it's the only thing left. 
these training programs that the responders have set up? How many survivors were running through these? It takes a certain calling to voluntarily run into the middle of a fire. That's a level one, Jesus. Looks like they kept up that... Oh yeah, I forgot. I'm a cop today. Even as the I'm Officer came. Toast. Reporting for duty. I'll be changing the outfit each stream. I need to find out what they Let's get to my camp so I can deposit all of my junk. And then do the physical uh, exam, which is in the middle of Char Charleston. And that's gonna be fun. Frame rate wise, we're gonna be see about we're gonna see about three or four frames total. Probably. I don't know. It's literally right in the middle of the city. I think my character tried to jump there and it it just didn't. I don't want to refresh these immediately already, but I'll just refresh the two that doesn't require a lot of time. See, those two you can do just, you just interact with it and that's it. Oh, the lemonade stand's gone. Rip. Alright, get ready for like negative frames. I have a couple of nuka colas too I can use for this. It's just like a training course. Oh my god. It's getting bad. And I'm looking down. I'm not looking up. I don't want to look up. That'll make it worse. I might as well while I'm here. There's a uh, very low chance of getting the uh, fusion rifle plan here. Some goodies. It's at the top though, let me see. Oh no, they know I'm here, they know I'm here. Oh, hello! What gun is that? Ow. Unlocked. Guys, I didn't even want to fucking play. So stop bothering me. This takes forever. I need this thing to be stronger. Can you not? Fucking joy! Of course, I don't even get to see the gun they had. Uh, oh, it's usually here, there. Nope, single action revolver. Great. Just fucking great. Oh, and now that I picked that up, that plan won't spawn there at all, no matter what plan it is. I'm pretty sure that's a one per, once per day type of thing. Drink some water before we run. Come on. Initiate. Three minutes. Great. Will begin in 15 seconds. I can smell you out there. I'm gonna drink my Nuka Cola beforehand. Exam oh, and initiated. wine too. Activate initial checkpoint. Because that's good for AP. I hope it actually started. I think it did. Uh, I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm super lost. Jesus Christ. No, where am I going? Oh my god, the fucking sign is right there. I'm so confused. I need to have this on. I can't see anything. Oh shit, really? Am I going down? Ow. This seems very dangerous. Oh, feed the people. I should actually do that one. Because that one's very easy and it gives you some, uh, uh, an XP boosting item. I should go do that in a sec. Plus, it, yeah, it's it's really easy and it's good for a low level like me. Eh, I'm like medium level at this point. 
Anything above a hundred, uh, anything above fifty, is uh, high level. I don't, I don't know where the course is. I think it actually goes around. But I'm just gonna, I'm gonna head straight there. Oh, gross! It smells like poo. Smells like Snallygaster poo. I think the Nuka Cola wore out and the wine as well. Things uh, don't really last long in this game. Something like, like a chem that would last like half an hour in Fallout 4, it only lasts like a couple minutes in 76. And I kind of hate that. It makes chems kind of pointless. There are perks to make them better and last longer, but. I wish it would just be equivalent. Alright. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, initiate the final... Is it this terminal? Oh, son of a bitch. Let me initiate it and then we'll head over to the event. Can we not, please? I need to get, like, better stealth. Oh. Uh, Items like there's I can do uh, stealth legendary armor. There's also some better stealth perks as well, and I can even just modify the regular armor to have a, the be stealthier. Okay. Okay. Let's get over there. Oh, no one's here. Great. Hello, peoples. I'm sorry. I just realized the YouTube chat was not updating. Hi, Daniel. I don't know if you're still there. And hello, the baby crippler. Jesus Christ, what a name. Thanks for joining. 80 is not high level. I think I said 50. I mean, based on, like, the way the game handles levels and how everything is usually either... 15 above or something below 50. 50 is meant to be high level. Above that is high level as well. 25 is medium level. Because there are activities that say level 25 recommended or 30 recommended. That's like the medium levels. I'm, I'm starting, to be a, uh, starting to become a huge fan of this spear. Even though I don't really use it like a spear. Oh, I need to power this up. I kind of wish this actually functioned like a spear. Can you not? Gotta start collecting everything. Ooh. Ugh. I need to grab the legendary perk so that it auto opens level zero locks. Gotta find more faster. I'm just gonna eat it all. There's a lot of it around here. there might be some back here as well or not great more crossbow bolts that's exactly what I need God damn it. you not oh it's three three and three they changed it it used to be way more than that Meat flavored soy chunks. Lovely. Damn it. Ow! It clipped me through a wall. 
Leaf flavored soy chunk. At least the veggies are real, right? Right? Ow! I'm crippled and drunk. In game. Meat? I need meat. Not dehydrated beef stock. Ew. Oh, hold on. Oh, I missed it. Son of a biscuit. Meat? None of them are meat! Meat! I found meat! Sorry, not meat. Jesus Christ. The average- I don't need to know the number of calories in a baby. What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god, my problems just got worse. This is gonna be difficult as by myself. Oh right, they spawned right in front of him so many times. That's bullshit. Get the fuck out of here. How are you crawling through concrete? You cheaters! Okay, that was excessive force, dude. Upstairs! I'm gonna end your species. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> I'm scared right now. I don't know what's going on in the chat. See if anyone will use a uh, lunchbox. Some people are pretty generous. I do not have any at the moment, unfortunately. They're crawling through the roof, too. You see the dirt coming from the ceiling? The mole rats seem to be a little broken. Uh, why is there only two people in the team? Hey! How are you crawling through that? That's not dirt! Stop cheating! Oh, there was meat right here. Damn it. Uh-oh. I'm ready, just in case this is the pipe. I'm ready. What's the problem? It's the valve! Someone release the valve! <laughs> I heard someone... One of the people in the background talking. That's so funny. Oh, come on, dude. I'm upset. I'm not getting any XP. Dude! Why are they so quiet? I thought... It should be louder. I don't know what's going on. A level 34, hello. The building is shaking. This is going to take a while. Oh, never mind. It starts to take damage over time at some point.
I think I just blew up the boss's car. Damn! Wait, 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 wait. Are we good? I think we're good. There's more coming. That's crazy, because they come up from, from the roof. Why did they spawn on the roof? That makes no sense. All right, I'm ready. Is it the pipe? Is it the pipe? Tell me it's the pipe. Here, I'll break the pipe so it's the pipe. Damn it. <laughs> Somebody get it, please. There we go. All right, we got 40 seconds left. And then we can do some story. God, sometimes it like delays my ability to use the weapon when I switch to it. I got it, Jesus Christ. Overkill, overkill, overkill. That was a war crime you just committed. A power armor as a reward. Great, that's exactly what I wanted. Alright, and the, the thing I really wanted was the canned meat stew. Because that is, uh, I think it's 10%? XP bonus? I don't remember. I'm gonna head back to base first and uh, deal with whatever junk I have on my character and also refresh all of my stats. Why do I still hear them? Today's okay. junk output is error. Sensors are dirty. Right, and this thing also produces junk as well. I gotta check that every so often. And I probably have some legendaries to sell. Let me do that real quick. Oh, just that one. Oh, right, I'm full. Or not full. I'm uh, out of uh, the legendary currency, legendary script. Oh, I think it gave me that gas mask at some point. Let me just make some room here. Honestly, I literally never use healing items outside of stim packs. So I'm just not going to bother with with the drams Greetings that responder. Duchess gave me. Requisitions are now available. Ooh, a stealth boy. Okay. Okay. Let's refresh everything. Well, th this is what I mean. I wish I didn't have to refresh all these so often. Oh, encrypted is on. Nah, I don't need to do that. Although it does... There's a very low chance that I could get it. But there's a very sought after plan, gun plan for that event. I don't know if I can get it if I haven't done that side quest that that starts bef that you do before encrypted. But uh it's a suppressed combat rifle variant. And that would be perfect for my build. Uh, I don't know. 
Encrypted doesn't happen very often. I should go do it. Although I will absolutely get wrecked in that. I will not survive very long. So I'm going to die over and over again. So I'm just going to prepare real quick. This is it. We'll do encrypted and then we'll finish. We'll do the rest of the stream just uh, doing story. So let me just get my stat boost real quick. Because it takes a while for it to actually start. And there's going to be people there. There's going to be a lot of people. Because that's a very uh, popular event. But it doesn't happen very often. So I am missing one of these machines. There's seven of them total. for One for each stat. And I'm missing the one for charisma. I think I need to go buy it with gold because I missed it when it was available. This one is for um, perception. Yeah, this one's perception. Uh, that one is... Intelligence for some reason? I don't know why. Strength, uh, endurance, luck, and agility. The one I'm missing is charisma. It's bas it's basically like a arm a wrestling like an arm wrestling machine essentially. Uh yeah, let's go do encrypted. And get absolutely wrecked. I could try to stay stealthy, but it's mostly robots. And it's gonna take forever for me to kill even one. I can try to do as much damage as I can. Then I can get the XP at the very least. Has it already started? All right. Listen, Sounds like it might have. If you're hearing this, that means I left unfinished business for you. That don't sit well with oh, me. Oh, it just started. What the fuck's going on over there? You just initiated the recall process for a rogue assaultron. A tough one. This thing's got a shield so strong, hardly oh. anything will Oh, it's already active. It's vulnerable. It's right there. Oh my god. See what I mean? That person got wrecked immediately. There's no way in hell I'd be able to survive this. That was 33 headshot damage. With, uh... With a uh, critical through vats. I don't know if anyone's going to be able to do this with... Help me with this. Look, I'm already getting wrecked by the robot. And I'm a pylon too, so... I'm slowly getting drained. Because I'm basically connected to these. And they're shocking the shit out of me. Okay. It's vulnerable now. Why is it stuck there? It seems like it's stuck there. As long as the pylons don't die. Okay, it moved. Right. Oh, I'm glad that body- Oh, right, this is a robot. Body shots don't mean- or headshots don't mean shit. Oh shit. I'm gonna waste a lot of stim packs here, unfortunately. I might have to do some, uh. Some, uh. Medical. Medical item farming after this. Everyone's fucking downed. Meanwhile, I'm fucking being shocked at that slowly. Oh, what the fuck? It gave it to me instead! My bad! Ow, ow, everything hurts. I'm already a pylon for two. I'm already two pylons. I need someone else to do another pylon, please. I don't know if this is going to happen. It's a legendary, too, so at some point it's going to restart. Or, uh. Um. Oh my god, it's so fucking fast. I need, like. Damage resistance. Oh, I don't think that helps at all. My stim packs are about to run out. Yeah, it's a legendary, so at some point it will... It'll, uh... It'll reset its health. Please, everyone. For the love of God, kill it. I 
I'm dead. Yep. I can't be the uh, pylon for this. Because I'll just die immediately. And also, uh, yeah, no more sim packs, pretty much. I've got like three or four left. I guess, uh, even. Well, are you kidding me, dude? What are you, unbloodied? I only have like two, one left. I literally have one. Oh my god, dude. I'm not picking up again. I'm sorry. I literally have no stim packs. Or maybe just one. I don't know. Can someone else be the pylon, please? Ow. Oh, thank goodness. Alright, let's see if I can get the plan. If I get the plan, everyone here, if they knew that a level 20 whatever got the plan, they're gonna be pissed. They're gonna be absolutely pissed. Ow. No, I don't think I got it. Um, we can always check. No. No, I didn't get the plan. I didn't get anything remotely s helpful there. Uh, whatsoever. It's a low chance anyways. What did I get though? I got something Sheep Squatch related. Didn't I? Oh, Imposter Sheep Squatch Helmet. I'm glad I got that. So helpful. But I'm playing as Officer Toast today, so I don't want it. Um, let's get rid of this stuff. Oh my god, that screenshot! There's a bunch of dead people and a dead cow. What the hell? When did I take that? That looks awful. The shadows looked really bad in that. That might have been back when I had the 1060. Or the 1080, I mean. Right? Yeah, I had a 1080. Back in the day. No, I had a 1060. I'm an idiot. I, like I went 960, 1060 adhesive. to 3060. I the graphics cards. Okay. I... I'm ready. Let's go do the main story. So we're gonna go back that way. So uh, now we're gonna do the final test and see if we're good enough to be a fire breather. Also, I think... I wanna see if I can get them, but there's like, uh... I talked about them last time. Um... So before the ultrasight weapons were made, there was a precursor set of weapons called the anti, anti scorched. And I think this is a 10 millimeter pistol variant, uh, a shotgun and something else, maybe a rifle of some kind. I think one of the rewards for this quest is you get the 10 mil pistol, I think with this, the anti scorch. It's basically a special uh, barrel. So it doesn't require anything special. It just requires the barrel on, on the town millimeter pistol. Uh, and it just uses regular ammo. Um, and you can also find the other two um, plans, but they're not anywhere nearby. They're like, I think it's by the big tunnel at the bottom of the map, essentially. Okay, let's go do the test. Although I have to take off my uh, officer toast uniform. Temporarily. To do this. Belching Betty. Hello there. Fire breather. Applicant detected. What the fuck's going on? Kick ticket issue. Please collect your... Sounds like something's flying around here. Or is it just the gas that's coming through the ground here? Yikes. Examination right. briefing. Hollow tape issued. Got my gunpowder. I'm actually kind of running out. Okay. Um, let's put that on. 
I don't need that on, do it? No, okay. Leading on equipment is not. Welcome, recruit, to your final exam. I'm Hank Madigan. Did it not give me the 10 mil pistol either? Exam simple. Oh, yeah, it did. There it is. Anti scorched. Down there and come back up. All you gotta do is survive a little slice of living hell. Okay. Scorched. Call it home. Oh, yeah, and it, it does look visually different. But the bullets are not different. It's just the barrel. The, the barrel. The receiver. It's just a receiver modification on a regular 10 mil. So, this is what they had before. Um, Along with your suit, you before ultra sight weapons. We figured out the scorched aren't big fans of depleted ultra sight. Took a field trip to AMS HQ to figure out how to make the stuff, but it's the most effective tool we found for putting them down. This guy had one too many. I'm gonna take their last one. Suit up, strap in, and move out, recruit. Okay. This one is short, but I, you know me, I'm going to get super distracted. So we go in, activate the beacon at the end, and then get the fuck out. Easy enough. Also, I think there's a bunch of dead miners here. Or, uh, fire breathers. Yeah, 47 damage. That's an S that's a pistol too. This needs an extended barrel or a magazine. Another one. Let me see if there's a uh, workbench around here. I'll take that and that. Those are valuable. There we go. Ooh, aluminum canister. Nice. Let's keep going. Wait, hold on, hold on. Oh, a nuka cola cranberry. Also, I should have eat, uh, eaten that stew. Canned meat stew plus 5 XP for an hour. 5% XP. Yeah, that's the only reason why I did that event. Because that'll go a long way. Okay, squad leader. Tim and Andrew are both dead. Now what the hell oh, are we rip. supposed to do? Shut up, Sai. She's recording. Entry T. We've lost. I guess I missed entry one. And the rest of us barely made it past them alive. I'm beginning to think Melody Larkin may have underestimated the difficulty of this exam. Oh, this was just the exam? Jesus Christ. You're damn right she did. This is suicide. What the hell with this? I'm going back. No, you're not. You're sticking with us. Why? So we can get picked off one by one until we're all dead? No way, not me. You know what, Sai? You've been acting like a coward ever since we started tapping the scores in the farm. And now, Tim and Andrew God, the are recall dead this because is insane. Of what the hell are you talking about? I saw him, Max. When those scores were put through the tunnel, <laughs> they came at us from all sides. Tim and Andrew were holding, and they told him Sai to watch the back, but he did it. He ran away and left their rear flank wide open. That's what took them down. Jesus. I'll bug you knock it off. Sylvester, if you want to go, go. But you're going back alone, and I guarantee we didn't clear everything behind us. Even if you make it, mark my words, you'll never be part of this squad again. Rip. Damn. Fine. Sylvester well, sucks. I'm out of here. You're seriously letting him go? Oh, someone left the team right when Sylvester yeah, left in the, in the holotape. That That's off. really funny. Perfect timing. I wonder what, how does this compare damage-wise to that Ultra Sight version of this? 
Tommy Whacker blade. What the fuck? That was the thing I just found. A uh, lot of shotguns. All minor gloves. Yeah, this really could use an extended barrel. Or start, I keep saying that, extended magazine. They explode randomly because of the legendary perk I took. Uh, nothing. Nothing of value. Alright, here's the beacon. Man, these two made it to the very end. Rest in pieces. They've been here for quite a while. Uh, uh, run. More of them spawned. How's the weather for you? Um, I cold as fuck, pretty much. That's it. I think it snowed a little bit. It wasn't too much though. It's just gonna be really cold and and windy for days. It's gonna drop to uh, zero in a couple days. Zero Fahrenheit, which is not fun. It's gonna go. It's gonna drop like twenty degrees in one day, I think, which is insane. It's gonna start feeling that the long dark for sure. How about you? How's the weather over there? There are some like. Uh, resource nodes here, but I don't know if it's worth it. This is black titanium. I think. Yeah, I don't really care that much. I don't even know what black titanium is used for. So there was a... Was there holotape I missed? I don't even know. Those were the first two corpses I saw. I, don't, I thought there was... I don't know if there was more than that. Oh, I think there was only mention of five people, so those first two corpses were the first two to die. The one that was by itself in the middle was uh, Sylvester then. And then the last two at the very end were the ones that kept going. You got a blizzard? Damn. Oh man, I hate the cold. I'm cold right now. I need to turn on the heater after this. I should be putting on winter socks. I don't know why I'm not. All hey, I'm alive. Examinations complete. Congratulations. Issuing orientation hollow tape. Please proceed to oh. Charleston Fire Department for company registration. Hey, I'm graduating. Hell yeah. Let me take this off. No, not the gas mask. Officer Toast is back. Um, I do not want that. I don't like power armor in these games. I never have. Eh, it's a short stroll. No need to fast travel. I really miss, uh... I, I don't even like summer, because I hate the heat. But I, I prefer... Um cooler weather so I, I wish it was I hope um, spring comes early basically I really hate the extreme cold and I hate the extreme heat and sadly I live where I have both of those throughout the year 
And the weather is a bit bipolar here sometimes because I live like next to the Great Lakes. So we get a uh, lake effect weather and that often causes massive fluctuations in temperature and uh, weather. Like one day it could be 60 degrees, almost 70 degrees. And then the next day it could be snowing, just lightly snowing. It's insane sometimes, the weather we have here in the Midwest, especially along the Great Lakes. What's going on in here? Okay, anti-scorch does not equal anti-rat. Put you on a skewer, Jesus. Yeah, I really wish I had the legendary perk for this. It just auto opens the lower level, um, like locked containers, and then you can upgrade that to continue increasing the number of levels. It'll auto open for you. So if you if you max out that legendary perk, you don't even need the lock picking perk at all. Oh yeah, I should probably fix that. Um, I actually took a stat that I didn't want. I think I took agility by accident. Yeah, I took... No, I took luck by accident. Because I don't need this perk. So I can take off a point from luck and apply it to something else. Intelligence, maybe. So I need to scrap a card. Uh, this is kind of pointless. How do I scrap? Oh, it's F. No. Uh, unequip. I think it's insane that it costs one perk point to, to unequip a card. Uh, Master Infiltrator. There it is. So now I can auto unlock zero term uh, level zero terminals and locks. Wait, what was the other thing it said? Plus three lockpick and hacking skills. Wait. Auto unlock skill zero terminals and locks. Plus three lockpicks and hacking skills. Wait, hold on. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, rank up. Does that mean I have I can I can now unlock level three? So do I even need lockpick anymore? How did I not notice that before? Okay, I don't even have it equipped. Okay. So I need I need more stealth perks. Which is all under agility. Some of the ones I want are uh, locked to higher levels, unfortunately. So the only one I have available right now, I think, is sneak which i've already maxed out and then there's one that's equivalent to this it increases the damage you do when in sneak but this one's for melee there's one for guns but it's not until much later i think it might be like locked until level 50 which is insane i guess i could hold on I need to I need to replace this commando perk at some point with something else. Like I just don't know what to equip at this point. Cuz I have everything I would use. I oh, you know what? I can go for a higher level pharma pharma. So I can do that. Let me rank up luck. But I'm going to grab Actually, we'll just grab Pharma Pharma 2. I need to go get more stim packs 
So I need to go farm uh, medical boxes. So uh, let's finish up here and then we'll head out to do that. Nice so to anything see to sell. People coming to Charleston. This yeah, so the cranberry Nuka Cola is like an is an XP item, but it's only two percent XP. I don't know how long it is, it, how long it lasts. Twist, what does twist do? Twist. You need supplies. I am programmed to trade match. Oh, May. oh, I'm In I forgot. There's like a there's literally text here that's. Like, <gasps> Oh, Jesus. Test what... Text that says what it does. Applies a random positive effects. Restore health. Okay. Okay. Sounds interesting. Maybe next time I get into a fight, I can use it. You know the drill. Buy and sell. Okay. Sell a couple of these. Because I like to keep a minimum of those. Oh. Do you have any stim packs to buy? They only have the shit ones. Okay. So, that's down here. Oh, that was for the first aid test. So, I think I can now access this? I'm not sure. Where's the room that I'm supposed to be? Oh, it's upstairs. Ah, uh, I just jumped down to... How do I get up there? Besides that other staircase over there. Oh, here we go. I thought I was already up here. Okay, it's the terminal. There we go. Uh, register new fire breather. Okay. Uh, schematic archive. Oh, yeah. See, you can get them here. Standard issue, which is a 10 millimeter. Support. So, okay, yeah, this is, uh, you can only get the schematic from this person, and they're not here. They went to the tunnel at the bottom of the map, and you can find the, the plans on their bodies. Shotgun. I think the support means SMG, maybe, I don't know. And then rifle. Yeah, they're all at the tunnel. Okay. How, what level is this, uh, pistol? 25 and it's got it's already got anti-scorch on it and it's got a good condition bar too so honestly i might just update this real quick let me see if it has a suppressor uh option i think it does now who am i talking to oh the priority message there are eight jesus thousand holy shit Oh, okay. Yeah, delete the rest. Melody, whoever's down there, it's Madigan checking in. <laughs> At long last. You're over, I'm up here just outside the top of the world, and I found something. Dweller. Something I think Glad could be game changing. Don't ask me where I got it. Okay. I just need you to send back up. Honestly, this is, uh. Best guns you can spare. Call me back at this frequency. Is it a complete. Like, like this. My memory of whatever happens next is like a complete blur. I don't know what the thing he's talking about is. I just know where he goes and what happens to him, but I don't remember what exactly he's talking about, like the thing that he found that's going to be a game changer. I honestly don't remember. This next part of the campaign is <laughs> very lengthy and is a lot of bullshit. But the good thing is that um, a lot of this next part of the vanilla campaign was actually integrated with wastelanders like a good chunk of it i think it even got overhauled i'm not entirely sure All but questions should be uh, directed to my, my the quest that i'm about to do for the vanilla campaign will actually apply for um wastelanders when i do that eventually so i'm gonna do progress for both campaigns kind of oh wait what oh you can't modify it Oh. That's, uh... That's news to me. I thought it was just a standard 10mm. 
with anti-scorched barrel or whatever it's called receiver this is kind of dumb so what were the plans that I just got Um, didn't I just get plans for something? Did I not get them? I'm so confused. I thought this was just a 10 millimeter with the modification. Fire well, now, fire now I need to do, just get another weapon, basically, th at this point. For this build. Oh, oh, see? There it is. Okay, it tells you. 10 millimeter pistol, SMG, assault rifle. Okay, so if I take my SMG... What... Can I modify this to be anti-scorch? Because this... Vanilla campaign is mostly- that's the wrong word, Benjamin, idiot. Is mostly Scorched related, so having this, modif this modifier is actually a good idea. Oh no, that sucks. Hopefully they were okay. I'm glad I don't do a lot of driving. Um, okay. Scorch, oh, it's called Scorch Killers. It's different. So that pistol is, is, uh, is actually completely different. That's, that one is hard locked to be anti-scorch. Oh, I got a Zealot's Pipe Wrench. Oh, that sucks. Look at the damage difference. Oh, you know what? I think it's it's less damage because it does more scorch damage. Okay. Actually, that's good. That's good. That's going to be my melee weapon. Cuz that spear does more way more than the pipe wrench because, you know, it's a spear but also I think anti or anti scorch decreases the damage on it. I don't remember if that's the case. Um I can, if I had the perk, make it more damage. So right now, this would do 30-something to Scorch, which is actually still less than the spear. Right? 25 plus 50% of 25. And critical hits, I think that applies to VATS only. Which I don't even think works with melee weapons. I don't think so. No, let's get rid of that. This one's going to do more damage. Oh, it's a training. Yeah, it's a completely different gun. Okay. Um. Examination complete. Please proceed. Trying to think what I'd do with this SMG then. Let's go to the base real quick. Nope, I didn't want to do that. I'm trying to decide what I want to do here then. Because I could go get the 10 millimeter pistol plan, but I feel like that's a waste. I could check to see if there's a, a location where you can find it for free. Because you can find weapon plans for free. It's very rare and does uh, rotate. There's like a set number of plans that could spawn in a certain location at one time. So, uh, like earlier when I found the plan in the uh, that one office building... What was that plan again? The single action revolver or whatever? That could have been the fusion rifle as well. So that's what I need to find. I need to find 10 millimeter pistol plan for Fallout 76. And then find a potential spawn point. No, I need the plan, not the actual gun. And then see if there's one nearby. And I can buy it. That's the problem. I want to see if there's a place where I can get it for free. Because it can spawn. 
Plan 10 millimeter pistol. The wiki isn't really helpful here. Yeah, it looks like you only really can buy it, or you got to be very lucky and have it spawn as a reward from an event in the forest, specifically. Um, so we're just going to do anti-scorch 10mm SMG. So this build is going to be scuffed. Oh yeah, I found out the Soul Survivor... Uh, weapon that I found is a is a lever action. It's that's it's a unique lever action. Uh, so it's got assassins, which is bonus human damage. Uh, more damage while aiming, more damage resistance while aiming, and it's got night vision. And that of course has a suppressor too. The lever actually, yeah, the lever action could get could be a good weapon for this build. Yeah. Yeah, I think that might be what I could do at some point. But for now, I need something else. Because this doesn't have a suppressor. I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. I'll just put on... Anti-Scorched on this for now. Or Scorch Killer. Whatever it's called. Yeah, this is dumb. I wish... I thought that was an actual just 10 mil. Oh, I need Ultra Sight. Mm. Ultra Sight. There might be some over here where the... It's one of those late game resources, too. But you can find it. Also, I should probably mark it. Oh yeah, I noticed that this is starting to bug out the um, component view. It was starting to uh, not show all the different components. It's see, it's not even showing ultrasight. I need to go to a stash box and grab some, then it'll hopefully show it. Yeah, it's just like not showing everything for some reason. There we go. Nope. I have a perk already? Jesus. There we go. Ultra sight. Oh, right. I should probably just get rid of this. Um, is this all scrapped? Yes, it is. What am I still carrying that's super heavy? Oh, the boiling water. Or boiled water. That's a lot. Get rid of that. Uh, these are not heavy. Okay. This wrench I can put away. Because I can't scrap it at the moment. Get rid of that for now. Okay. It was like the boiled water and the wrench. So I need to find a fissure site. I think they can spawn an ultra site. But I gotta be careful because it can't sp- Oh, yep, see? Is that a legendary? It is. Oh my god. Wait, level- Oh, I thought it said 80. Never mind. I thought it said 80. I was freaking out. I was about to say, yeah, I'm definitely not going to be able to kill that. Oh, they have an auto SMG. Oh, yeah. Or, uh, auto, uh, grenade launch, I mean. Here I am fighting a fucking Scorch Beast by myself. Once again, distracted. Hey, can you not? Oh, hello. Ah. 
Can this Scorch Beast come back to where I was? Come back here, Legendary. This is going to take for fucking ever. No, it's not worth it. It's a two-star Legendary. It's really not worth it. I just need the Ultra Sight. Oh, there's a fucking army of Scorch coming. Can we not? Can we not? Jesus Christ, I'm gonna get murdered here. I don't even know if there's Ultra Sight here. I thought there might be, but I guess not. Yeah, something tells me there's no Ultra Sight here. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, we're leaving. That's fine. I could just get I could just go find some ultra sites somewhere else. I'll just leave. Don't I wanna head into that forest over there. Oh, some of these plants look like they're mutated. Like they were recently nuked. Can you not? Oh my god, they're all following me still. Let's get the fuck out of here. <sighs> I think the only thing that has Ultracite in it is actual just Ultracite. And also, uh, Scorched Materials. Are you really following me this whole time? Are you kidding me? Do you guys not have anything better to do? You stupid hive mind. I'm not going to be able to fast travel because this is Scorched Beast. Oh, and they're still following me. I'm not here. Oh, Brotherhood! I'll help! I'll help! Sorry, Brotherhood! This is gonna take a while. Can't do much about the Scorch Beast, though. Can you stop blocking? What is this, Skyrim? Yeah, you're kind of on your own, buddy. The knight's definitely not watching this. I need to get the fuck out of here. This is fucking impossible because of the damn Scorch Bees. It won't go away. Can you not? I'm trying to fast travel away. Oh my god. Holy shit, I'm gonna use console commands real quick. Oh wait, never mind, I can't. Fast travel away! No! Go away! <laughs> no! Go away! Be gone! All of you, be gone! Oh my god, never again. Let's just not go there. I know the world is unleveled, but holy shit, those enemies are hard. They're supposed to be easier. Hello, Beetlebee. Thanks for joining. Um, do you eat people in this game? Uh, you can? Uh, question mark? <laughs> yeah, you can, actually. Uh, wait. Yeah, you can be a cannibal. There's a, even an uh, animation and a sound effect. Uh, let me respond to a message real quick. Radiation rumble. Absolutely not. All right. Uh, let me look and see if there's a source of ultra sight that doesn't get me killed immediately. That would have been an interesting build, actually. A cannibal build. Hmm. I'm rethinking my build. 
ultra sight. I love that it doesn't say anything about the sources. Yeah, there's nothing in here about ultrasight locations. Let me type in ultrasight farming in this and see what happens. I don't even need to farm it. I just need a few. Oh, wait, can you actually grab the ultrasight from the hole in the fissure? Oh, you saw the cone about to <laughs> The calories in humans. Yeah, that was, that was pretty scary. Okay, fuck it. Fuck ultrasight, fuck anti-scorched, all that bullshit. We're just playing the story now. We're just gonna play the story. We got a long fucking way to go to do the vanilla story. I don't care anymore. Um, That is a long trip up. But I guess we're walking there. Holy shit. Like, this game has so much going on in it, but like... A lot of it is is locked until later. Uh, there was... Uh, previously in the game, the world did have, like, levels to each zone. And for the most part... Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? Oh, that's their base. It's floating. Like, each region would have a level to it. A level range. And for the most part, the enemies would be within that range. But uh, a couple years ago, they de-leveled the whole world. So... You can go anywhere at any time, and you'll find enemies that are at your level. But if you go to end game zones, like the fissure sites, uh, some of the late game locations, those will have uh, higher en level enemies. Scorch beasts are generally higher level, too. Hold on, I'm, I'm removing all of these because these popped up. I wish there was someone closer up there. All right, we're going to just make our way to the uh, top of the world. The fuck happened here? Oh, dear God. Oh, no. No, let's not go in there. I'm pretty sure my stat bonuses are gone, too, so. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about that. What's going on in here? Nice. I'm glad they set this up with nothing in it. Alright. I wish there was a vehicle for me to take. <laughs> That'd be cool. Yeah. Baby Clippler was a uh, interesting name. And they brought some interesting content to the chat earlier. Oh wow, they killed a, a Grafton monster. Oh no. Oh no. I'll put it away. I'll put it away. I'm an officer of the law, I swear. Okay. Okay. Don't need, don't need to piss them off. There's the top of the world. You can see it right there. Yeah. I put all my junk away. I definitely didn't. But when I get there, I can put away what I have. This location actually has some potential legendary enemy spawns. They could technically spawn anywhere, but there are places where there can be more. This one has a couple of opportunities for some. If you see the glowing green enemies, that's that's a legendary. 
Sometimes this will happen. Glad they haven't fixed that. Actually, I think they did fix it, because I don't think that was in Starfield, that bug where they don't fully animate when they die. Or, like, they don't ragdoll, essentially. If that isn't in Starfield, then maybe they did fix it. They just didn't bother to fix uh, backport that fix into 76. Because it's the same engine, I think. It's just upgraded, the Starfield one. I, d I did notice that when Starfield came out, I started to notice... Um, a lot of the Fallout 76 quality of life features were in it. So I, I like to think that they definitely took some of the work they put into this game and put it towards uh, add, put it put it towards Starfield. Like adding some nice quality of life features. Because this game does have a lot. There's a lot of simple stuff that this game has that I really wish 4 had. I really wish they would backport it. But I don't think they're interested in, in that. Or maybe they are... And they're going to wait until the um, the next gen or current gen update, whatever you want to call it nowadays. Because honestly, whenever we, we call whenever we call something next gen, it makes me want to cringe. Like really badly. Because that makes no sense. Um, current gen, which is the, the uh, PS5 Series X, Series S generation. Uh, whenever they do that update for Fallout 4, maybe they'll add in some quality of life features from 76. Maybe co-op? Please? I would love Fallout 4 co-op. For the love of God, please. I would rebuy the game. If you forced me to, to just to get co-op, I would rebuy Fallout 4. I would do it. It would be worth the 60 bucks. Could you imagine Fallout 4 co-op? Oh my god, that'd be amazing. Holy shit, please do it, Bethesda. I will pay 60 bucks for it. Oh, I just had milk and cereal. That's so cool. I've been wanting to eat milk and cereal for days, and I keep forgetting to in the morning. Well, that was cream, but you know, it's it's the closest to milk and cereal. Oh, right. One of the uh, Scorch Killer was an assault rifle, but the assault rifle is ugly. I'm stuck. You saw nothing. I was talking to you guys in the chat. Nice. I meant like you didn't see me miss. I actually think these are low enough level they... Oh god, the frame rate. That uh, I could just hit them in the body. I don't know what the fuck going, happened in here. This crater. Oh yeah, aren't there a bunch of safes in this building? <gasps> I hit the jackpot. It's the credit union in Milton. Oh, they're all open. Most of them. Are there none? Oh, there's one right there. Oh! The perk does let me open level up to level 3. I have to unlock it still, obviously. Okay, the legendary perk. I didn't know that before. I don't know if that was a recent change or... If... Yeah, your skill level 3. So that, not only is this legendary perk... It auto-opens level 0 terminals and locks. It also gives me lockpick and hacking skill 3. So that's... That's two perks I don't need to get. Holy shit. I don't know how I didn't notice that before. Hello, zombie robot. Have a little cookie. Thank you. I appreciate it. But I'm full. I'll save it for later. Thank you. Thanks for joining the stream, and how are you doing today? Yeah, you can do that. I found that I, I know I knew about that a while ago, but uh, I only recently realized... Uh, What is this, Lethal Company? Uh, I only recently used that to my advantage once. I, uh... I needed to do some... something, and I had... I pulled out a... a flare or a torch or something. And, uh, lit it and just dropped it on the floor. Oh, it was a flashlight. I need to... I need to, um... 
do something and I turned on the flashlight and put it on the floor. Yeah, I I I knew about that. I just don't use that feature often in the game. All right. Let's get out of here. There is a killer robot somewhere around here and I'm trying to avoid it. I think it's over there. Or maybe up ahead, I don't know. It just spawned right next to me, didn't it? Jesus. Um, someone just triggered the firecracker berries. There's a berry bush that if you stand next to it, it, it the berries pop because they're called firecracker berries. It's these red berries that you can see around here. Something triggered it. This turned into a horror game all of a sudden. Speaking of horror games, I've been meaning to see if if the Whispering Hills mod for Fallout 4 got an update. Because it's been over a year now since I played it on stream. And that was fun as fuck. It's basically... Oh, Actually, I could probably take him. It's basically a remake of Silent Hill in Fallout 4. And I, I don't think it was full... I don't think it was complete when I played it. I want to see if it's if it's been updated recently. Because I think I played through episodes one, two, and two and a half. I don't know if two and a half was meant to be three or episode. I don't know. But I'm guessing there was another episode to the game. I'm I'm totally down to play some Fallout 4 mods, like quest mods. Like I used to back a couple years ago. I did a, I was I started a whole like series on that. And then kind of stopped doing it because I was tired of the mods breaking on me. What was that noise? Actually, what killed my my desire to uh, play Fallout 4 quest mods was uh, Sim Settlements 2. Sadly, which is... Sim Settlements is considered one of the best mods for Fallout 4 ever. Like, quest mods. Um, but Sim Settlements 2 was so buggy for me, at least... I just could never finish it, and I put so much work into it, and I my desire to continue to play Fallout 4 quest mods just disappeared. But I would I'm totally down to play like smaller quest mods in the future. Ooh, I don't know if anyone else is interested in it, but uh, Fallout 4 London, which is a quest, not even a quest mod, it's a whole ass freaking game modded game basically added added to fallout 4 uh that is coming out in april i'm excited for that oh there's a human here uh that it's basically a modded campaign added to fallout 4 made by uh modders just about time to eat and that's coming out finally that's been teased for years Some hello better for firewood. Others better for building that's something i'm gonna, i'm going to be doing in april for sure playing that and settlers and Are you, could learn a thing or two about what real work is usually you can talk to them Can't i just live out here in peace some trees are okay i guess firewood. they don't want to talk sometimes this specific in, uh, encounter will offer some free wood not that kind of wood please jump we're almost to the top of the world i can literally smell it Oh, yeah, top of the world's gonna have some bad frame rate as well. Oh, um, these are the firecracker berries. They pop when you get near the bush. Actually, I should have probably let it pop on me. Oh, here's one. Are you. Oh! It was a delayed reaction. It does hurt you a tiny bit. It's kind of cute. I like that. That's a very unique plant. I used to have a base up here for many, many years. This was a nice spot because it was right in the middle of the map and next to a trader and next to a big story location for the game. 
Someone's playing guitar up ahead. Oh, the frame rate is just gone. Oh, I miss my mama. I miss your mama too. I mean, what? How did it get to this point? Nothing happened. I'm stuck. I think they know I'm here. Oh. <laughs> they don't know I'm here, though. Uh, they do know I'm here, but uh, they don't know where I am. Oh, headshot. The s sneak perk is broken as fuck. I hate my thoughts. I hate my thoughts. I hate my thoughts. They literally can't see me. Until they like walk right into me. How did that miss? Headshot. You know what? It might be a good idea to reset on my base here. Just because I'm going to be hanging out up here quite a bit. Uh, for the next uh, act of the, of the main story. That's going to hurt in the morning. What is that sound? There's a weird sound in the background going on, but there's no one near me. So I have no idea what that is. Also, there's usually some goodies around here. Oh my god, there's crossbow bolts everywhere. It's usually a uh, bobblehead here. Oh shit. Hell yeah, beautiful. Alright, I need to scrap everything. Man, this legendary perk is insanely overpowered. God damn it, the crossbow bolts need to stop. It's not funny anymore. This is where I would have my base before. Right across the street from the trader. Let me see if it's available. This is why it was so popular too. It was hard to get the base here. Because of that little resource node there. Yeah, we'll move the move it here. I'm just going to move this out of the way temporarily. And place this, which is what I had before. Where's the entrance again? There it is. So I'll make sure that's facing the other way. Damn it. Ugh, it's gonna complain about support. It's literally got support. Why is it not al allowed to be placed here? Oh, I, I thought I had it. At some point it'll happen. God, this is so annoying. Hold on. All oh, right, free cam mode is a thing. Oh, this will be so much easier. Hello, me. <laughs> Look at me down there in the bottom right.
I don't get what it means by it needs support. It has support. It has platforms that literally are the support. What do you want me to do? Move this. Will this work? Oh my goodness. I'm glad that Starfield has a vast improvement over this in it. Oh my goodness. What does it want me to do? Like, I don't understand. What does it mean by it needs support? It has support. It has plenty of support. Just gonna try to find a spot that it'll it'll accept. This was a mistake, I think. Trying to place this. I have bugged out now. Oh my goodness. Why is this such a pain in the ass? And that's money. God damn it. Hello, Luca. How are you doing? Oh my god, Bethesda, what do you want me to do here? There's literally support underneath the structure. What do you want me to do? What does it want me to do? I don't understand. It literally has support under it. I fucking hate this with a burning fucking passion. This feature has just been nothing but stupid bullshit since the beginning, since Fallout 4. God damn, dude. I can't place it anymore because it won't let me. Oh my god. Well, it's partially in the ground. Great. Fucking finally. And of course, it's not even, like, positioned correctly. Just fucking... Please fucking kill me. In-game. For the love of god. Oh, uh, this will absolutely need defenses. Because this area is kind of hostile. And uh, it's going to be much safer for them to be on top of my stations here. Because if I put them on the ground, they'll just get mauled to death by some rad, ro rad rat or something. Son of a biscuit. It won't work. Fuck it. I have more than one or two. Is there any what is going on? Than oh my god, I just want to play the fucking story. Wait, there we go. Will this really not work? Wait, I saw it for a second. Okay. It's a weird angle, but okay. I guess it's acceptable. All right, let's refresh all this shit real quick, and then get to the main story again. You mainly play Fallout 4? 
Fallout 4 is fun. Um, this does play like Fallout 4. It's... It's identical. It's just got multiplayer and stuff to it. Um, which I'm not going to be focusing on at all during the series. Except when, uh, when it's convenient for me to do so, I will play a public event with people. Like, I did one earlier that gave me a, uh, a special food item as a reward that gives you bonus XP. So I, I will do that when it comes up. Just because I'm low level and I could use the uh, XP boost. So, this auto rifle, or assault rifle, yeah, it has Scorched Killer. Ugh. This thing's so goddamn ugly, though. We'll, we'll, we'll forget about Scorch Killer, forget about Anti Scorch and all that. I don't care anymore. Oh, you know what might be weighing me down? Um, the 600 crossbow bolts I have. Oh my god. The stack weight is 40. No wonder. Holy shit. That's a lot of freaking arrows. Or bolts. Also, I'm, I'm going to start putting these away as well. This, see, the stack weight for this is only three. That's insane. Do I have the ammo reduction, weight reduction perk? Um, trying to remember what category that's in. Oh, bandolier. There it is. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's go for a strength point. And we can grab bandolier. Now the crossbow bolts will be lighter. Well, all the ammo. Actually, it says ballistic ammo. Are the crossbow bolts considered ballistic? They are. Okay. I think just like missiles and... And, uh... Grenade launcher grenades and mini nukes don't count. No, stop triggering PTSD. Preston Garvey isn't even born yet. Stop doing that. This is like... What? It's 2105 in-game. When is he alive? 2280-something. 2281. This is like 140 years before he's born. 140, 150, give or take a decade or so. Stop it. So much of Fallout's history happens before he's born. Oh, you should probably do something about that mold, buddy. Uh, I already did agility. I need strength. And perception. And sleep. No, I don't have to save the settlement. I make the settlement. In this game, you make the settlements. You don't, you don't save them. Half of the original game was literally just investigating se uh, former settlements. Everyone is already dead. Just investigating what's happening, what happened there. That's what half of the main original story was. For a 76. Not literally. My fortune teller is also taking a nap. Also, there's like a hot tub too. Which gives you a bonus if you use the hot tub. It gives you like some kind of stat bonus. I forgot what it does exactly. It might be like, uh, like AP regen or something like that. Like higher regen. I don't know. But uh, I don't have the jacuzzi or whatever it is hot tub. There we go. Yeah, I really wish these. These uh, stab bonuses would last longer, so I don't have to do this like every half an hour. The world is my dumpster. All right, there we go. And that's the last one. 
Oh, I do have a bunch of armor to go through. Let me see real quick. And then I can scrap the rest. Right arm. Nah. Nah, it's all shit. And oil spill. I have never seen anything. So Perfect, let's go. Main story time. Oh. Is that Grom? It's Grom! I haven't seen him in years. Hey, buddy. Got anything good? It's a named uh, super mutant. It's a traveling vendor. It's kind of rare. And they also have a special event in the summer. Um, I mean, I'm probably not going to buy anything. Although, I think I can wear... Yeah, I can wear this. And Trapper's armor is pretty decent. It's a decent Need amount of money, though, but I'll take trade? it. Stuff? And Moo Moo! Charlie the Moo Moo's here. Simple. This is adorable. Also, uh, handmade gun. Oh, I don't have enough. Fuck. This is one of the most popular guns in the game. Right? Uh, it's the, uh, assault rifle looking, or the, oh, sorry, rifle. The AK looking gun. But it's, it's makeshift. I think you can find it in other places as well. That's a pretty rare find. Hello, Charlie. I miss you, Charlie. Goodbye. Oh, no, hold on. Goodbye, Grom. Goodbye, Charlie. I'll see you in the summer, maybe. Gotta bring some good meats to the summer. No side dishes like... Like, uh... Potato salad. Nah, Charlie doesn't want that. Or, uh... Grom doesn't want that. Take some donations. Oh yeah, I'd never I rarely play that game when it's foggy. I just stay in, stay inside unless if I know the region like the back of my hand. I I don't like playing in the fog. Once visibility is at zero, I stay inside. Welcome to the top of the world. This place used to be Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Speaking of jump scares, Oh, I accidentally clipped that. Slight improvement. Oh wait, was that legendary? Oh, that was legendary. Um. And it's better. The only thing I'm gonna be losing is the regen. This place uh, has changed over the years, but uh, this used to be like surrounded by enemies, and it produced one of the one of the times I played here produced one of the biggest jump scares I've ever had in my life, uh, and that's actually a clip on the channel somewhere I don't remember where, um, where a a rad scorpion popped out of the ground. But it didn't make noise. It was just behind me randomly. Like it just popped up out of the ground out of nowhere. Uh, and it was called a Death Skull Rad Scorpion. Which is terrifying. If you've ever seen one up close in, in this game or in Fallout 4. Overseer's Law, top of the world. Oh, There's Overseer's Pissed. Great mentats, nice. But the only way she'll tell me what she knows is if I help her first. All 
the good people I've learned about who've died. And it's the sociopath who still gets to live. Alright, delete some stuff. Alright, let's head up. Yeah, remember when Fallout 76 originally had no NPCs? No way. Oh. Fix my radio signal. Oh, right, right. Got it, got it. That's a different quest. Let's turn off the missing link first. She wants me to do something first. I guess I'll show you later then. Over there, fuck. Again, no fast travel location, so we gotta run there. Yeah, uh, I was gonna say, you'll learn that uh, that wasn't true. There were NPCs in this game, but most of them were robots. And I guess the, there was only one non-robot NPC, but we never really saw them in the original release of the game. That was the Overseer. We didn't actually find the Overseer until later. What are you knowing about? Did you just die in the long dark? Rip. Uh, but that robot back there was one of the actual NPCs in the game. There were NPCs, just not human. There was one human NPC, but you never found them until um, later in the story of the game. This bug is kind of annoying. Because it also, like, ruins the ability to loot them sometimes. Shut up! God damn it! Try to be quiet, Harry! Son of a bitch! It's still not dead, what the fuck? Oh! Shh, 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 shh. oh, right in the head. See, I wish this would consistently work as a spear. Like, why does it do the side swipe? That's not what a spear does. Stop being a shovel. Be a spear. Something happened to Daniel, and I'm assuming they probably died in the long dark. Oh yeah, everyone, make sure you leave a like on the live stream. And also subscribe and hit the notification bell if you haven't already. Also, subscribe to- or subscribe. Join the Discord. The link just popped up in the chat a little bit ago. So that we can start our own little community here and discuss the long dark. Other games as well, of course. Um... Uh, Totally down to talk about Fallout or Skyrim or or Destiny 2 or, or whatever. Lethal Company, WWE, we could do all sorts of games. Share memes as well, etc, etc. <gasps> Pumpkin pie. And that, for some reason, that lasts you a while. I don't know what it does though. Let me check. Pumpkin pie gives you... Oh, it heals you over time for over an hour? Or an hour. Plus you get max HP for plus 40 for an hour. Holy shit, that's a really good effect. Why am I not making pumpkin pies? That's incredible. The plus 40 HP is really nice for over for about an hour. That's a really good effect. I know of a couple pumpkin pie spawns, so I can go steal them. Whenever I'm near, near a spawn. Ah, uh, look at Seneca Rock right there. There is, there's actually, uh, one of the mini DLCs for the game included a camera with, like, a bucket list. And I couldn't complete the bucket list because you had to climb this rock and take a photo from the top. Uh, I could not figure out how to do it. It took me so long to complete that bucket list and I could never finish it. Because of that one photo up there. But now there's, like, jetpacks and shit you can use to get up there. But I don't have a jetpack. And I don't have time for that. 
Um, hopefully I don't get mauled to death by a by a death claw out here. This looks like death claw country. This rock is also ow. This rock is also very tall. Oh my god. It doesn't help that my FOV is not standard. It looks way taller than it actually is, probably. Look at that. Look at the nuclear power plants over there, too. Oh, and that's Morgantown, too. Down there. That's where it was the last stream for this. The uh, airfield should be over there. Oh my god, I just realized where I'm standing. I can't do this like I, I, I do in the long dark. Or Skyrim. This won't work, really. Oh, the trees look awful from up here. What the fuck's going on with them? I think my... My CPU might be having an actual stroke. Is it leaky memory? What's going on? Yeah, the trees are like... Actually, like... Smearing on screen for some reason. Oh, what's this? Oh, I wonder if that's a soil meter. There's like a side quest to uh, test the environment for pollutants. Okay, I'll make sure no enemies down there. Yep, I knew it. Missed, of course. That was embarrassing. Nobody tell. Nobody or nobody saw that, right? Why? How? How do you already know I'm here? I'm supposed to be stealthy. Oh, they stopped. Aggro then. Their aggro disappeared. I'm sneaking. There's the region boss or the local boss. It's got that little crown on them. Gold. Wait, did they say gold? Oh my god. Shut up. Alright. Let's grab what we came here for. Oh, a quantum. Hell yeah. Oh, oh I broke it! Damn it. Mmm. Delicious. Oh, that was a responder. Interesting. Major Darian Jones. Oh, is that alive? No, that's not alive. Raider Thief. The Yagua is dead, right? Yeah. It's the old bear. Someone killed it. Please stop getting stuck in this little hole. Okay. We got a red rocket here, which is good because we can we can uh scrap all of our shit and put it away. I I don't like the decision to put uh, scrap boxes at red rockets. Like every red rocket has a scrap box in it, and a scrapping st and like some kind of workstation to scrap all your junk. But then they put like five, five red rockets in the game across this massive world. Like this, this game has is very massive. The world map, and there's approximately five red rockets. I wish they would have put more. Any legendaries I can put away? That one. Good God Almighty, wasn't this the same? The same place where the drug addict was? Wait, what are you talking about? Oh, are you talking about my character jumping? 
I mean, I do have a lot of stuff on me. I think this is pounds, though, not kilos. Oh, I need to put the fire breather stuff away. It doesn't weigh a lot, but I don't want it on me. Oh, and uh, gas mask is actually kind of helpful to have. In case you walk into an area with poison gas. Uh, search for... Oh, God. I actually passed one of these. What the fuck? Why is there two down there? I passed one of these on the way up to the top of the world. It was at the trains where I fought the robots. Oh, the motel. <laughs> That's funny as fuck. Mm, yeah, they probably use that to sell drugs. It's at a national park, so yeah, probably. I wouldn't be surprised. Alright, maybe the robots are gone because I killed them already. Nope, they respawned. Perfectly out of my way. How do you see me? Do robots just not give a shit about sneak? Man, this Mr. Gutsy is weaker than the than the eyebot. Ow! Got it. Let's get the fudge out of here. And then the plane, which perfect perfectly placed camp there. We can just use that to fast travel. I hear something else over here, and I don't want to fight it. Never mind, it just died randomly. That happens sometimes. Don't worry, it's just a quirk with the engine. <laughs> it's probably why all those uh, innocent humans were just dying left and right next to me. The last stream. Where can I find that motel? Just asking for a friend. Um, you're gonna have to go to Seneca National Park. In West Virginia. I think that's what it's called, IRL. Wait, is that Grom? Again? Oh, no. Um. Okay. I've never seen a super mutant do that. Only scorched and ghouls. Interesting. Mm, pardon me. Okay. I didn't really have anything else, did I? Okay. While I'm here and it's relatively quiet and peaceful. Oh, I don't have any more perks. Never mind. I thought I had a perk card to grab. Oops. That was premature, I swear. Hello. Oh, whoa, hold on. That was the wrong emote. I don't want them to think I'm in love with them. Awkward. Get away from me. Ah! I think they want to kiss me. Run. <laughs> this emote is one of my favorites. Okay, this is full of super mutants, so this is going to take a bit. But if I do the stealthy way, I should be able to pass most of them. Are they still following me? Ah! They're trying to kill me. I, I'm kidding. You can't do that anymore. Better not be following me. They're following me. Oh, oh my god, it's scary. It's a serial killer. Run.
No, 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 no. G Milton, the cave to Milton is in Mr. Lake. What are you talking about? It's in Mr. Lake. It's by the trapper's cabin. What? Who's there? This fucking asshole ruined everything. I made it here peacefully and quietly, and they just had to fucking ruin it. Oh yeah, I need uh, medical supplies. We're going to the airfield real quick. <gasps> Bobblehead! I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Okay. Yeah, go to the trapper's cabin. The cave is right next to it. That leads to Milton. Yeah, you're probably looking at an old map. Oh, look at that, that uh, Flatwoods monster. That's pretty cool. It's the most elusive enemy in the game. I mean, quite literally an alien, too. All right, I'm going to just really quickly just run through the airfield because I need medical supplies. I need stim packs. Uh, let me see if there's any in the donation box. Nope. I got a Molotov cocktail. Oh, what am I doing? Uh, there's just a lot of medical boxes here. Uh, did I have that perk enabled? I just got a perk card, didn't I? Or a perk point. Shoot. What do I need? <sighs> Honestly, like endurance. Yeah, I'll go for an endurance point, but I'm going to try to get a uh, card from something else. But there isn't anything that's helpful here. Oh, these are the new ones. Okay. Arms Keeper. This is a new perk, re like relatively new. They finally added in cards that affected the rifles. So there was only one that would give you more damage for rifles. But there wasn't one that would reduce the weight of rifles. So using a rifle was always a disadvantage. Now, rifles can have their weight reduced. Everything else used to have one. Like shotguns had one, heavy weapons, melee, pistols. Uh, but not rifles for some reason. But now they do. Which is great. Batteries included, that's reducing ammo for energy weapons. Um, I don't know what I could really use, though, honestly. I guess more crossbow? Do I have room for that? I guess I can get rid of this. Yeah, we'll go for... An endurance point, but we're going for a crossbow. Um, yeah, more crossbow armor uh, penetration. Wait, what? Oh, right, I took off three points. Okay, so we can put something else here. Although I don't really need it. You can view a target specific damage resistance. Ah, sure, why not? And then this, I'll put dromedary. So that my water quenches more of my thirst. Perfect. Yeah, and I have pharma farmer on, right? Yes, tier two. Let me see if I can do this without getting notice by any enemies. The sneak card is pretty broken. Not possible. As you can see, I'm right in front of them and they're not noticing me. Nice, but not what I'm looking for. Ooh, excellent. There might be another one here. They're, these are medical tents. Excellent. I need stim packs. Oh, 
<gasps> Shh, they haven't noticed me yet. Oh. Uh. Oh god, a commercial. I'm sorry, I have no control over that. What? You just broke the rules. You just broke the rules. You just ignored my perk. Now you're dead. I'm taking your cup noodles too. Asshole. I don't think there's one in here. But I'll take that clipboard. And in here, I don't think there's one in here either. Yeah, I don't think this building has a medical box for some reason. Oh, I should probably scrap stuff here. Why does everything have crossbow bolts? Like, I get it, contextual ammo. It's the, it's the weapon I'm using. But please, can I get like something different? Something more valuable? Ah, someone already opened the stash. Damn it. Wait, what? Got a couple plans here and there. It's kind of helpful. Ooh, canned coffee. Look at that. That's kind of hard to find sometimes, but then, like, at some point in the game, uh, you just get it, like, randomly, and it comes up more often. I don't know why. Like, maybe I'm, I've gotten to the point where it starts spawning. Oh, nice stim pack. But uh, it's so weird. Like, why doesn't it spawn early on? Yeah, this building will have some. Potentially. No, I need stim packs. Please. Damn it. Damn it, and usually there's a stim pack just sitting there too. Not this time. Hell yeah, there we go. Yeah, this room usually has like one or two stim packs just sitting on a table. Mmm, bourbon and cigarettes. Okay, let's check upstairs. Sim pack? No? I don't remember if there's one back here. Oh, there we go. But that's still not a sim pack. Okay, and there's like two more buildings I'm going to check, and that's a... Oh, three, I guess. Well, yeah, the four, I guess. These tents, I forgot. Nope, three. I already checked that one. And I guess I already checked that one. Two more buildings. No, we're not doing this event. Fuck off, game. Single action revolver. I love the way this gun looks. But man, it is super slow. Look, look at this. It's beautiful. The reload on this is the problem. Although I don't have any spare bullets. Also, yeah, it's a single action too. I just forgot about that. Stimpack? Damn it. All right, let's get out of here. Um, 
I guess it says construct it at a tinker's workbench. Uh, real quick, Flatwoods, the agriculture center, does have a bunch of medical boxes around it. So I'm going to just check these real quick and then construct the thing I need to make for the story. And I think I'm going to end the stream after this mission. Man, I wish that I didn't fuck around so much. But I do really need the stim packs. How many do I have now? I think I was down to like three at some point. Okay, I got 13 now. 14. But I really need these because I'm low. Two of them, nice. Excellent. One more. And I don't remember... Oh, wait, there's one more building. I don't remember if that other building down the road has one. Or has some. But it's usually occupied with enemies or... Or friendlies. Nope. Was that it? I think so. Let's check real quick. I think these are the same buildings too. Same style. As the ones that I just looted at the airfield. So this other one over here. Might have some medical boxes. Oh, they're enemies. Unidentified intruder detected. Beginning search. <laughs> Why is it delayed my uh, the the use of the melee weapon? I think it thinks I'm in the middle of the reload for the crossbow. And it delays my, my ability to just use the melee weapon for some reason. All clear. <laughs> oh, two more sim packs, nice. Uh, nope, no stim pack there. Check back here as well. None. Okay, well I know- no, 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 Fuck my life. I know where to go. It's these silo looking buildings. Or wh whatever you call these. I don't fucking know. Uh, not silos. These are like- I don't, I don't know. But I, I know what type of building I should be looking in. I think there might be some of these at the other airfield by Charleston and maybe by the military camp. I don't remember. Um, I'll just go to my camp and do it there and end this mission and then we can end the stream here. Whoa, why is it purple? Why is the world purple all of a sudden? <laughs> Do you see this? What dro- Did I take some great mentats by accident? Does anyone taste purple all of a sudden? Oh, it's gone. Big sad. Alright, any legendaries need to go away? No. Mm -mm. Oh no, I god damn it. It's to the if you're looking at Trapper's cabin like from the front door the cave is behind Trapper's cabin and to the left along the rock wall. You can kind of see it from the cabin. I'll just grab these cuz these I can refresh quickly. Quest item. There we go. And then, don't I need to install this? Yeah, somewhere. Oh, so far. 
All right, start, time to start running. Do I have anything that does AP? I don't think so. I don't think there's any specific chems that do that in this game. Gives you AP regeneration. I think it's just m mostly foods that do that now. Alright, that's why I have the wine, max HP, and the quantums. I don't think it's it's increasing AP regeneration, but it's giving me more AP. Oh, it's the Subtler Wanderer. Hello. That's an ally, which is like a... It's like this game's version of a companion, but they're not really companions. They just kind of sit at your camp, and they give you quests. They have their own mini stories too behind each one of them, except for the, except the wanderer. I don't think she has a story, a mini story. If you look at a uh, map, you should be able to see it, but you need to look at a, at the correct type of map, like a. A relatively new one because some older maps wouldn't have it like if you're looking at maps from back back in 2016 they wouldn't have the connection between mystery lake and mountain town because mountain town didn't exist like those really old maps won't have that there's like a weird background noise that's happening i don't know what that is Oh, this is one of the nuke silos. There are nuclear bombs around here. In game. In game. Stop it, FBI. I just want to grab the location. Yep. Here's site alpha. No one's here. There we go. Not even any military survivors. Oh, nuke launch. Oh. Interesting. I don't think Bolt Tech asserting jurisdiction over the nukes would have gone over well. But I don't think that's supposed to be there, that hollow tape. Access is restricted to the highest ranking officers. I'm not gonna grab it. I'm gonna save it for later. We can't secure these sites. My God. The automated factory in the silo? Just how many nukes can it make? So that other holotape that was there, the one that said nuke launch, I think that's the one that's supposed to spawn at the end of the overse at the end of the main campaign. Like once you complete the main story and have collected all the hollow tapes, the main set of hollow tapes, and you launch the nuke at the end of the campaign. That additional hollow tape spawns, I think. I don't know if that's the one. And it's supposed to be her response to you dropping nukes. Cause you technically are includes the entire community, all the players. I think it's canon that we're just dropping nukes over and over again on the region. Uh, at least canon for this game. I don't know if this game is canon for the entire series. I have no idea. Appalachia Brotherhood looking at you. So I don't I don't want to grab that holotip because I think that's her response to the Luke launches. I remember there being an extra holotip that spawns after you collect all the holotips and complete the campaign and launch a nuke. Which, launching a nuke is a bit of a problem. It is a lengthy process, and I just have no experience with it. I think I've only launched one nuke before. Alright. And with that, Rose the robot now has access to the communication network. Uh, one of the biggest communication networks in the eastern side of the United States. I don't know, again, if that's canon for the rest of the series. So, if, if Rose is around... 
at the time of Fallout 4. I don't know. I have no idea if that's the case. Alright. Complete this, and then we can end the stream. Oh, it's early component. Nope. Fever power. Cool. This is an emergency alert. <laughs> End of the world, and we're all fucked! <laughs> <laughs> I love Rose. Oh, I'm addicted. Oh, shit. Um, oh, addict all. I don't have any addict all. So I was just gonna kill you and take your stuff when you came back. You came back at all, that is. Guess it'd be a real dick move for me to do that now. Look, I'm what you people would call a raider. Killing, stealing, and cheating is kind of my shtick. And thanks to you, I've got a working radio. So I can reach other like-minded individuals and get them to join me. You open the floodgates. Hey, come see me at the top of the world. Oh, yeah, I think, uh... I've got something for ya. I, and I pinky swear I won't kill ya. I think Rose is responsible for the raiders coming back. I think the, the settlers come back because they hear about the gold. And they also hear that things are quieter and, and the scorched plague is now manageable, kind of. Because we have the uh, inoculation. And then Rose is the reason why the raiders come back. And I think she... I think she tries to convince them to join her, but she couldn't convince them. So they, they decide to start their own groups. Which is why there's like different factions of raiders. All right, that's going to be the end of today's stream. This has been very fun. Uh, I honestly have like fallen in love with this game again. It's so refreshing after so many years and starting from scratch, seeing all the new quality of life features uh, and changes to the beginning of the game. And seeing how, you know, the game is relatively stable, finally, after so many years. And mostly bug-free. It still has the many, many buggy quirks that this engine has but at least for the most part it's bug free um so i'm gonna take a nap and we're gonna end the stream there so please make sure you leave a like on the live stream subscribe and hit the notification bell if you haven't already and uh also join the discord which i will link here in a sec give me one sec closing the game There's the Discord link. Join the Discord and we can... That's Dustcord. So that we can start our own community there and talk about different games and such. And also, um, if you want to uh, watch my stream highlights and other shorter types of videos, you can go subscribe to the second channel, at ToastyBits2. Um, that's where I will post YouTube shorts and stream highlights and smaller smaller videos that don't really fit on the main channel. Um, tomorrow will be another stream as well, of course. Um, I totally forgot today's only Saturday. So tomorrow will be this, the long dark, uh, live stream, the, the long drunk, which is going to be a drunk stream. Um, and we're going to be playing bingo. Finally, I've been wanting to do a drunk bingo. Um, but I think I did do a drunk bingo last month. Kind of. I don't remember either way um that's gonna be it for tonight join me tomorrow at 6 p.m central standard time maybe even earlier i don't know it might be it might be earlier so that we can get started early on the drinking um and we'll we'll be playing some the long dark bingo um and that's it for fallout 76 at least for now um because this is the rotating game for the weekend uh, for the weekends uh next weekend will be red dead redemption 2 and then after that it'll be skyrim and then we'll come back to um the long dark or, or the long dark uh fallout 76 at some point after that so every week it'll be a different game including the long dark as well all right that's it for tonight i will see you tomorrow